What items can you buy for your rabbits in a thrift store? Hello everyone, I am Mariska and I'm the bunny mom of four adorable rabbits. Today I'm going to take you to the thrift store because we're going bunny shopping. There are a lot of bunny products you can buy for your rabbits online or in physical shops. But I've discovered that there are a lot of products you can also buy in a thrift store. It's much better for the environment to buy second-hand products, of course. So that's something I really love. And I also love, you know, going through a thrift store, you know, to see all those old things and you know, to find things that can be interesting or fun for my rabbits. Before we're going bunny shopping, I'd like to tell you that none of the things in this video are sponsored. I've paid for the things myself. So uh, it's time to go to the thrift store and, you know, to see what they have today. So this thrift store is really huge. It's one of the biggest ones in my area. So I'm really looking forward to see what's inside. I usually take a lot of time walking for the thrift store because there's so much to see and I don't want to miss anything. It doesn't take long for me to find this wooden toy section. Check out this small wooden cart. Wouldn't it be fun to put treats inside? This can be something my rabbits can throw around. As you can see there are multiple wooden carts. This cart looks fun and suitable to hold treats. In the end, it's the first one I'm going to buy. If you like bunny decoration, this can also be interesting. Wooden bunnies. Look at all these products. I can literally stand in the aisle and look around me for about 15 minutes and still discover new items. Some things are really hidden, like these Easter bunnies. If you are looking for treat jars, this is the place to be. I have found that thrift stores usually have a lot of jars. Smaller ones and bigger ones, even ones you can use for the bunny's pellets. Most thrift stores have a special place for pet products. These can be used as litter boxes. There are also a lot of food bowls. This could be a comfortable bunny bed, although I would wash it and put it in the freezer for some time in case of critters. And there are more bowls. This one is sturdy and heavy and suitable for rabbits. As a bunny parent, of course, you know the importance of a good vacuum, but I'm not sure if these are still working. This wall houses a lot of tiny objects. Can you spot a bunny? This one is so adorable. I actually think this is a garden bunny. And no, I cannot resist. So here we have another toy section. Of course, I have stuffed animals like this cute bunny. Here we have a bead rack and this can be a lot of fun for rabbits. You can use this by hiding treats inside. I already have one at home and Poppy and Sulfur especially love playing with it. Many thrift stores have quite an assortment of tin containers. As you can see here, you have small ones and large ones, so a lot to choose from. Very handy for treats or pellets. This rabbit egg looks quite decorative. If you are bunny shopping, don't forget to look at the kitchen section. You might find some suitable bowls, for instance for water. These look like the one I'm using for Poppy and Silver. If you are looking for a suitable container for hay, this can be the one. It's actually a bin, but very handy. In fact, I'm using bins as hay containers myself in my house. Pet items can really be found throughout the shop. This pet carrier still looks very good. It is suitable for a smaller rabbit. 
but because I already have a lot of pet carriers, I'm going to leave it. This thrift store also has old towels which can be handy when you are grooming your rabbit or maybe cutting them nails or maybe when they are ill. It has many purposes. The second floor of this store is also huge. It might also be interesting to buy furniture here because then it won't be a big problem when your rabbit chew on it. Last of all, I find this cute bunny bed. And now it's time to pay for my small haul. So as you can see, I only bought two items for my rabbits and actually <laughs> one isn't really for my rabbits, but for myself. So to start off, I bought this cute little bunny item. It's one euro fifty. Um, I think it's so cute. Of course, I couldn't just leave it this in the store because, you know, just look at this. It's such a cute baby bunny. Of course, no bunny would ever sit like this. <laughs> But still, it's so cute. So, you know, I couldn't just leave it around there for somebody else. I just wanted it for myself. <laughs> the second thing I bought is this little toy. It's also one euro fifty. I think it's a bit expensive for something like this. Um, this, I think there was something in this once, but I thought I can use this, you know, to put a treat inside and my bunnies can try to take it out. And of course the cart will start riding <laughs> so i'm very curious to what my rabbits are going to think of this so we're going to test this to see what they think and um, you know it could also be something they can throw around play with of course we can never predict what rabbits will think of a toy sometimes they won't play with it at all sometimes they can have a lot of fun with only the packaging of a toy so we're going to find out <laughs> was interesting and fun to you and that you enjoyed coming with me to the thrift store maybe in your area there's a nice thrift store you can look for yourself and maybe you can find some things for your rabbits if you like this video you can like the video and you can subscribe to the channel if you don't want to miss any future videos thank you so much for watching